Good afternoon, guys. We are hanging out in the first turn of the track here at Churchill Downs. A lot of folks uh, preparing for a big weekend of entertaining uh, at home, watching all the fun we're having here at Churchill Downs. Doug Draper is with us, the Finlandia mixologist. And you've been here all day. Very busy man going around and telling all of us what we need to be doing this weekend. Hey, absolutely. We want everybody to be able to entertain like an expert and like a professional. And we're here just to show you a couple of simple, easy ways to be able to to, to bring the, the party from Churchill Downs to your house. So, of course, we, not we, I like mint juleps, but a lot of people aren't so into the taste of mint julep. You've made something a little different here for those who aren't. Yeah, absolutely. It's a little blasphemy to, to say we don't like mint juleps around here in Kentucky. <laughs> Better uh, not say that. <laughs> yes, but this is something just a little bit more crisp and refreshing. It's only the second year that we've uh, been able to feature this drink. It's called the Finish Line. Uh, it's made with the signature uh, vodka of the Kentucky Derby, right. Finlandia Vodka. Uh, we're just going to use an ounce and a quarter of Finlandia Vodka. And you can use um, the original or you could also use the grapefruit, right? And then it's very, very simple. We're just going to top it off with something that's on trend right now. We have grapefruit sparkling water. LaCroix at that. Yep. Yes. And then obviously a crushed ice because what's a, a derby you cocktail without crushed, crushed ice? ice? That's right. And then we're just do a nice little uh, grapefruit um, wedge down in, in it. It looks professional, very uh, okay. easy, elegant, but you're not spending all day making drinks for people. You're spending all day watching the horses. And, and enjoying the drinks. And, and enjoying your company, right? <laughs> I think you've equipped me to be a pretty good bartender. Two ingredients. How can I mess it up, right? Uh, you know, I've seen you drink and I don't know. <laughs> Wait <so>. a second. <laughs> okay, and I love the whole grapefruit thing. Everybody's really into the grapefruit taste right now. It's a nice alternative to all the fruit juices and sugar mixes. Absolutely. And the, and the sparkling water also, it's a, a little bit lower calorie. It's great for our waistline. Everybody's trying to fit into those pretty dresses and, and vests if you need to. So uh, I think it's a great drink. And then, um, you know, the, the, the bitter and, and a little bit of acidic taste that you're getting from the grapefruit is something that's just going to refresh your palate every time. Going to get you to the finish line. And, of course, you got to serve up some good old pimento cheese, cucumbers, veggies. Absolutely. People never think of a vodka pairing, but vodka actually pairs very well with a pimento cheese or, or a, a creamy cheese. And with pimento cheese being, you know, a, a Kentucky, Derby staple. Uh, we thought it was great just to put together a, a nice, fresh uh, little array of vegetables and crackers with the pimento cheese. So nice of you to bring us a little snack as we head into Derby Day tomorrow. <laughs> yes, yeah, so we're going to go in fully energized and fueled up for tomorrow's big day. That's right. Well, you have a great weekend. You guys have a great weekend as well. Happy Derby weekend from the first turn of the track at Churchill Downs. I'm Deanne Stevens, out and about.